Asphalt Green Unified Aquatics. There's Gormley. In lane two, Chase Travis, 15 years old, won the mile last night. She's been 16-0, in the 16-0 range, um, but only a sophomore in high school. Lane three, Morgan Scott from the Central Bucks swim team. And in lane four, you're about to take a look at Bayer. A great butterflyer, as we mentioned, top four in both butterflies of Olympic trials. Not the greatest summer. She missed this meet last year with a torn meniscus. Yeah, had a couple injuries last year. Yep, but yeah. she's back. Looks like she'll be swimming pretty well. We'll see more of her in the butterflies as they go through the meet. She was a 147.63 in the prelims. In lane number five, that's Sinead Eckstein from Nation's Capital, also under 148 this morning. In lane six is Jasmine Heller from Nation's Capital. Also from Nation's Capital in lane seven is Aaron Quinn. So a lot of those uh, white and blue caps from Nation's Capital. And lane eight, Lauren Johnson from the Long Island Aquatic Club. Yeah, you're right about Nation's Capital just having just a huge team and so how many, many swimmers. How many swimmers are on Nation's Capital? If you don't know this, I, you know, so I should know this off the top of my head. We'll have to figure that out because it's a very it's a large big team. number. I mean, having got to be one of the bigger ones in the country for sure. So for here sure. we go, Bear, as you'd expect, some nice underwaters, but also from Scott from the Central Bucks in Lane Three, and those two get to the wall at about the same time. Pulling ahead there. Bayer barely ahead of Scott. Nope, nope. Man, one of these days I'm going to get one of these <laughs> right. Scott at 24.72, Bayer 24.77, and right there as well, Eckstein at 24.82. You know, they say the hundredths are impossible to determine or deceive by the human eye. So Well, especially when you come into a turn. On the touch, you can kind of tell. Right, right. You can sort of get an idea. But coming into a turn, you just don't know whose you feet are going to get over quicker. Yeah, and the splash is all there. You know, you don't yep. know exactly. I'm going to guess it's definitely Scott now at 51.70. Yeah. Leads by about a quarter second. Eckstein just ahead of Bayer. Helmer is in fourth place, but it's for the it's the battle for the top three. And Morgan Scott from the Central Bucks has the lead. Good underwaters for Scott on this all-important third 50. Cassidy Bear trying to hang in there. She's a racer, so she could come home here. Morgan Scott looks really good. 119.01. All within three quarters of a second, those top three ladies right there. The top two seeds aren't going to be a whole lot quicker than they were this morning. Scott could be. They were all 147. Scott should be at least a 46 here. Coming on, Eckstein really making a push there in lane five. Scott trying to hold her off now. It's still Scott underneath the flag. It is. Scott's going to hang on and win this race. She does. In 146.60. Great swim. Eckstein was second in 147.01, and Bayer faded to third in 148.01.